ladies and gentlemen osteoarthritis in relation to rheumatoid arthritis so what is the difference okay good now in osteoarthritis this is a more local uh, condition and even people who have injuries maybe those who play football or those who go to the gym and you get an injury and you go to the hospital and you're told you have arthritis what they mean is you have osteoarthritis not rheumatoid arthritis because this is local and this is uh, systemic good so basically arthritis is just an inflammatory condition where a joint and the cartilage is being destroyed and therefore the bone uh, rubs against each other due to that friction you get the pain and the discomfort okay so for the osteoarthritis so this side is osteoarthritis and this side is rheumatoid arthritis so for the osteoarthritis you have chemical breakdown of the articular cartilage so this one the one that protects your bone from getting friction with each other is destroyed by chemicals or trauma or injury and therefore now it exposes the bone uh, to the other bone and therefore that friction is the one that causes pain and inflammation so that is osteoarthritis on rheumatoid arthritis is a different one now here we have an immune complex there is formation of an immune complex because of immune reactions and this complex is there for the ones that comes and destroys this membrane now once it destroys this membrane then you start feeling the pain and the inflammation because again you've exposed your bone to uh, your bone to uh, friction and therefore that pain so this one has to have an immune reaction formation of a complex and then destruction of uh, the synovial membrane and so basically that's the difference and this one is systemic this one is local so what are the major differences between the two number one we've already defined the cause so this one is due to trauma injury or chemical damage of the articular cartilage the other one is because of an immune complex that will cause an autoimmune reaction and then this immune complex is the one that will destroy the uh, synovial membrane okay so remember autoimmune is where your cells are targeting your own body tissues so therefore you can form a complex that targets this synovial membrane and exposes your, your, your joints to this pain. Number two, this osteoarthritis is de degenerative. What do you mean by degenerative? It means destruction of the, of the articular cartilage. So it is destroyed. It's, it's as simple as that. And then this one is autoimmune. So basically those are the causes. And then number two, Osteoarthritis is more common because this one happens everywhere. People with injuries, people with trauma, accidents, people with uh, injuries from football and stuff, even rugby. And the other one has to happen as a result of an autoimmune condition. And all autoimmune conditions uh, occur as a result of uh, poor dieting. Okay? Yes, that is the point. So it is more common osteoarthritis and less common is rheumatoid arthritis number three this one is a local one we already said that and this one is a systemic one good the other reason is this one is mono or oligo to mean it attacks only one joint because that is the joint that has suffered the inflammation or the trauma this other one attacks multiple uh, uh, joints or multiple uh, uh, bones why because the immune cells or the immune complex is not specific to one joint it attacks all forms of joints that have the synovial membrane good then the other one is osteoarthritis is unilateral so it attacks one side the other one is bilateral so it can attack both uh, 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 two sides so maybe the both hands or whatever because it's not specific to one joint again then uh, the last one is this one flows from the knee to the hip to the hand and then the spine so that is basically the flow from the knee to the hip to the hand and then finally the spine but this other one just affects the hands and the feet okay so yeah that is it so for this one management here management can be paracetamol so you can use paracetamol for management of this pain you can also use uh, some non-steroidal and inflammatory drugs and seeds for example diclofenac brufen and stuff but the drug of choice is paracetamol because that pain will just disappear but you can use this in extreme uh, conditions again for this one, you have to use corticosteroids like uh, prednisolone, uh, dexamethasone, so that they can uh, suppress your immunity and then clear the, uh, the reaction that your own cells or your immune cells are targeting your own body. So you suppress the immunity so that it doesn't target this synovial 
uh, membranes from other joints. So basically that is the management and uh, supportive therapy. So that is the difference between osteoarthritis and rheumatoid arthritis. Good.